Eunice, good to see you back, mate. And that was a, a, a lovely game to f send off that man right yeah, there, Wesley. Yeah, I mean, what? No better way of doing it, really, for Hulhan. He deserved it, didn't he? And the standing ovation as well. And even if he'd come on, not started, he would have got it because he deserves it. And loyalty in English football's going out the game. Mm. I think Adam Drury was the last player to have a testimonial here, and. The Hulahun will probably be last in a few years. I mean, as you say, it's rare, isn't it, for a player let, not only to, to have 10 years at a club, but 10 fantastic years as well. Yeah, and you know, people have been going on the last few days, oh, he wanted to go to Villa and all that. It's stuff, all that, him going to Villa. He was always going to stay here. I, I think that was more the media stirring up with Lambert going there than, than him actually wanting to leave. And, you know, the media have got to get a hype on something. Mm. Going away from Wes, I mean, it's hard to because he was he was he orchestrated a lot of the good stuff today. But it was good to see us come behind, from behind and win. Yeah, uh, it just shows that if we do play right, we can come from behind to win. If well, it's going to be hard next season because at least I say five of those players won't be here next season. It's going to be an even more uphill task than this season was. I mean, how do how do we deal with that? Because I think you're right. I think the likes of Gunn, the likes of Madison, will yeah. probably won't be here. Two of our best players. How do we deal with that? I think we've got to get the deal done early. If she wants to get us in the Premier League and she wants to stay here, Dealey, she's got to spend her money. She's got to get her money out and get us those players in early and build the team round Madison, round Zimmerman, Hanley, Closer, Gunn, Leitner, Reed. Build the team round them and we'll be top six. Hopefully. I mean, we thought that at the start of this season and, and we, we're coming to the end. It looks like we're going to be finishing 12th probably. What's been your general vibe on this season? Ups and downs, I mean, every season has, but this season there was a lot of expectations. I think us, the fans, were expecting a little too much from them. And, you know, we yeah, we had that good run and we got we done well against Arsenal and Chelsea in the Cups, but we, we just have too much, too much expectations, I think. And all teams around us were spending money and we weren't. The expectations were going higher and higher and we just fallen down as a club. Man of the match today? Got to be Hulan into I mean, regardless what anyone says, it just showed when he came off, the game changed completely. When he was on, he was orchestrating the team and he was telling them what to do. And it just shows we're going to miss him because he done so well in those 84 minutes. And, you know, no matter what you say, that will be a big loss, to, and not just on the pitch, but off the pitch as well, because it seems he was a big player off it as well. And, just sad day overall, really, but a good way to finish the season, I suppose. We'd look, we had to look forward to something. I suppose this was it. You're, you're a good man. Thanks very much. Mate. Cheers.